Yep, I got it. So yeah, welcome to Super Mario, your job is here. So yeah, I'm not gonna lie, I'm not gonna lie, I'm not gonna lie, I think that you can create, like, things with characters in Mario here. This Rabbit series already did that. Oh, Mario called Rabbit. I mean, remember the Phantom? So... Megabug? I, I really hope they don't do that, man. So, yeah, I've been playing this for quite a while, on that profile. But... I only got a. I'm not gonna lie, the beginning is slow. I think that's just to help new players ease the game. Okay, I will say this. It looks like I'm so paper like. Probably. Another reason why I got this is some of the bosses were unique. Yeah, but I would prefer my character bring back that that option. Part from color splash. No, I will not be doing that one. And apparently, everything they did with this game, quality of life improved. That is kind of color splash. I'll say this. Kiwi was a good character. But I wish they were more original design characters. More distinct. Really, Nintendo, this mandate. It's not doing well. Oh, it worked wonders. However, the flight is handy to Mario Plus Rabbit. Work London. Guess I know the rabbit character. That's the Mario and Friends. It's also characters like Phantom. I don't know if this is what intelligence is wants to do, or... I don't know. But I prefer more original looking characters. Like, remember, uh... What? I think Goombella? Professor Frankly? Port? Or Crump? And original enemies like the Quest, the x Ah, uh, it's Count Black! Heck, just keep the graphical style! <laughs> well, because this is beautiful! But I'd like to see a more original kind of character. The battle system, however, is 
an adjustment, but fine. Oh. And it rewards you somehow. For just battle. Let's go. Trust me. They actually made the coins more useful this time around. Um, so you're gonna want to get a bunch of them, I think. I don't know, I already made it up to the first world. World box. But I haven't beaten it yet. Ah, oh, yep. This wasn't paper, it'd be nightmare fuel. It's still a little creepy. Creepy, because everything in the Paper Mario universe is supposed to be, like, not like that. You ask me, I think the first three Paper Mario games games happen in the actual timeline. I well these other three games, you know, Sticker Star, Color Splash, Origami King, which we're, I'm playing right now, is in its own universe due to the more papery aesthetics and self aware that this is more paper styled. In the previous three games. Unfold and fold it into glory. Who else is going to torment Vinny? And also... I might be taking it slow with uh, making uh, gameplay vids. It's in the year of the villain thing, I don't think it's gonna work out. Now, the coronavirus came, everything's been hectic. So, yeah, I'll try, but no guarantees. And, uh, new thank you. Okay, a horrible thought occurred to my mind. If this is what the interpretation of the Paper Mario world deals with, if, then back in, like, say the main Mario world, it's probably a nightmare. Here, we're getting the kid-friendly version of it. Now I, the reason I say is that I think that the first three Paper Mario games are canonical to the main series is because the designs look diff different from when you notice them from Color Splash, of the enemies. Like the Hammer Bro didn't look like that in the Paper Mario games, nor did the Spike, or the, did all the Koopa Troopers, or the Buzzy Beetles. You know. It was from, I think, Sticker Star onward that they got more self-aware of the paper style. Like, they understand that they're all paper. Er, and Mario stopped talking and having voice lines in the Sticker Star. Or, unlike like the past three the Paper Mario games. Well, he didn't have any voice lines in the first, but he did have them in the second and third. Huh? 
Yeah. They do not know what will happen to them. Yeah, the text could go faster. I wasn't planning on it. Also, I got another controller. It's the uh, Power A Pokeball controller. Wireless. It's a great controller, but no rumble feature. It has motion control. I think I could probably use it for skin too. Do it once I get a Bluetooth 5.0 adapter. Maybe it'll help me with Doom Eternal. Eternal. I don't know what I'm gonna do. With uh, Cause that game, I'm probably gonna have to upgrade my computer once again. Like get more RAM in it in a higher PSU. As I checked out what was going on behind the scenes, it bolts, and I understand the computer's multitasking of recording the video and doing the game. So the game, either the game gets choppy, or, or the video gets choppy. Oh yeah, Vinny probably memed this. I haven't watched watched his uh, videos on this one, but probably should. Like I'm tired. When I say more original characters, I mean more like Olivia and King Ollie. And the Volumental. Well, I already got to the Earth one, but I think there's more. Like, some sort of dragons. From what I see in the trailers. Tried not to spoil myself too much. I haven't been down here in ages. Wait, Bowser's minions are here. And that's Bowser! Wow. Okay. Thank goodness this is all just paper interpreted. Imagine what up the Paper Mario's third dimensional counterpart went through. This is just the kid friendly version of the story. If this is the case, I don't know what's going on with the canon. But I think the first three Paper Mario games are indeed canon. 
even as I said before, but I don't think these three are, because uh, I think Paper Jam and kind of explain things. Well. Oh, like, Sticker Star was a huge change in the series. Right, mainly not for the better, I'm gonna say. Sorry. Intelligent, I like achy boys. Boys, but this mandate is not really helping. And you gotta break the news to Nintendo. And though and ask to sign original characters again. If you're, well, up for that, I mean, it's, you guys are making the game. Wow, that Killing Joke reference. Speaking of, uh, Batman. So, apparently... James Tyron pulled a twist and gave... gave, uh, and had Joker steal all of Bruce Wayne's money. Look, I don't care about the politics, this is just a no, if you're gonna keep this change. Like, a poor Batman is not good. Money is his superpower. Unless you... You're talking about, like, Oliver Queen giving Bruce Wayne money. And then, eh eh. I mean it. Either he's gonna need get help from, from the original Blue Beetle, if he's still alive. Or Oliver Queen. AKA Green in Arrow. Look, I understand what you're doing by kinda of taking away the a lot of the gadgets from Batman, but hey. Giving it to Joker, like an analogy, and reuniting the Bat family. That I like, but I think you should keep the money thing just to that story. Alright, you can have Bruce be more cautious. Yes, or have character development, but... It's sick. Don't do this because politics. Everybody knows one needs Batman's superpower, and that makes him awesome. Um, besides, he even uses that money for good to begin with. But have none of you watched the animated series? If you're that upset about Batman being a political narrative. Sheesh, politics drinks the fun out of everything. Why I say it's cancer. Or it's like a tumor that grows and grows and spreads. Huh. 
nowadays. Whew. Also, correct me if I'm wrong, but Got married to Peach in Super Mario Brothers Deluxe? I don't know. My memory's fuzzy on that. I know I made it past Bowser, or like as a child, with, I think, a friend or a cousin's help. I didn't own the game, but I played it. This almost made me go, nope. I'm, this was almost the thing that <laughs> made me what, go back to GameStop. But, and then I got over it. I will say this, this is a nice twist. Just with the story. Alright, it's a huge improvement of, over the other or two titles, like Sticker Star and, uh, Color Splash. He, like, literally... ...really fold up the, like, a one-poly model. Are they all modeled, or are they in their own coding? Doing, like, certain tricks. X because this game, like I could probably take a pencil and draw it, and it would look like I made a pencil mark in the game. However, I'm not gonna do that because my teeth, they don't want to like wreck my TV or anything. <laughs> Like, I understand what they were doing with the full soldiers. Just like adding their own twist while sticking to their guns. And trying to move around the mandate, but I think this mandate should really go. Oh, it's not helping. Dang, allow them, like, make the original character. I mean, it worked wonders if Mario put Rabbit's Cub like a record player. I've been trying to stop that. Alright, let's just get to it. And yeah, they've actually improved the action command. Especially the hammer. I like I can get the timing right now. Well, two with the older one. But yeesh. Let me play. Or at least allow the text to scroll faster.
Personally, I miss where you just pull back on the control stick. Like, and just released it. Again, it's still kind of finicky with the hammer, but I got, but it got a lot better. Dysfunctional, huh? Bowser, you should probably take a look in the mirror. Also, just in case if I still can't record the Eternal on my computer, I upgrade it. I pre-ordered the Switch version, so hopefully that thing will be announced for a release date before October. If not, then I'm pushing it back along with the week mention three again. It'll be just Dark Moon. And maybe some two mods and wads. Like, I'm seriously gonna probably do these uh, gameplay videos as a side pro project, or like a side hobby now. But I, like, had the idea, like, like, ooh, I could probably make money off this by just, by just playing video games. And, uh, no, that's not the case. Okay, so I started to realize that there are actually... They represented copywriting material. Well, then it's not as easy as it seems. It just feels a little too time enveloping. Do something like that. Look, making money is great. But I prefer to have a little more heart and soul into some things. Things, and I... Really don't want to do the whole YouTube thing for like a, a bare necessity. Especially with all this weird stuff going on with it. As of late, with uh, the copyrights, you're Takedown. Demonizations. Yeah. I hate to sound like, like I'm negative or something. When I have the idea of doing it, I thought I could probably reach some other project. Like, nah, that's... Later!
Okay, I know it takes a while for some people, but I really want to do like that much time. I mean, I wanted to have fun with it. I don't want to keep things get out of the way. I'm sorry if I just free anybody. <laughs> I'm going a different direction. Yeah, I'll keep another project that tries to put it those videos. Said that. I'll be putting more time to that. Projects? They'll have to probably stay. Okay, that was fun. I'm not gonna do that all the time. My time to So far. Oh yeah, and if, um, my mic settings are a bit weirder. I adjusted the audio settings. So, feedback is great. Hey, as long as it bites. Yeah, it kind of takes the whole color splash mechanic of painting. It kind of mainlines it. Oh, and then there's my mic. Oh, okay, it worked. Good. That was almost bad. Sorry, you had to hear that. As I was saying, it takes the whole idea of color splash's paint mechanic, but it kind of like streamlines it into one thing. Thing where you just don't need a certain color to paint, paint a certain object. You're like out of that certain color. You have to go search around for it. Now you can just hit hit whatever you want with the hammer. Boom, done. And confetti pops out. Fill it with confetti. But I prefer a new mechanic over the confetti. Maybe. I don't know. Oh, but if we're gonna keep that concept, make sure it's just streamlined like the confetti. Again, filling things with confetti feels more streamlined to rather painting. Less tedious rather than gathering a certain color of paint. Confetti just does it all in one go. Oh, like you can find confetti everywhere and you don't need a certain color of it for a certain object.
Knowing Luigi, he'll live. I will say this, I love that saving animation. We'll find out who's been whispering here. Ready? The round. I forgot the whole force thing. Finds us together. Something, something, something. Yeah. That would have been a great joke if I did run it right. Nice. Yeah, I missed that the first time. I will say this, I also got Pokemon Mystery Dungeon DX. 
so I guess you can probably expect those whenever I upload it. Eh. I'm going to turn the mic off for a little bit.
talking to me.